Hey everybody, this is Fulio and Vale of Echale Porros Productions and today she's gonna show you guys how to make some awesome cinnamon, cinnamon rolls. rolls. So let's get started with our ingredients. So into the bowl of my stand mixer with a dough hook or you can also use just a regular bowl with a wooden spoon. We're gonna add two and three fourths cup of flour. To that, we're also going to add one packet of instant yeast or around two and one fourth teaspoon. One fourth cup of granulated sugar and one half teaspoon of salt. So we're just gonna mix this up. Now into a microwave safe bowl, we're going to add one fourth cup of water, three tablespoons of unsalted butter, and one half cup of milk. Now we're just going to heat this in the microwave until the butter is completely melted and the entire mixture is warm to the touch. So once you get it out of the microwave, you can add it into your dry ingredients. <laughs> Did you see that? And one egg. Now we're gonna mix this together until our soft dough is formed. Always be sure to scrape down the sides. So once our dough is formed, we're going to dump it out onto a lightly floured surface. So now we're going to knead this for around three minutes. So now that we kneaded our dough for around three minutes, we're just gonna put it into a lightly oiled bowl and we're gonna cover it just with a dish towel or kitchen towel and let it sit for around 10 minutes. So after the dough has risen, we're gonna turn it out onto a lightly floured surface and begin rolling it out. So we're going to roll this out into about a 14 by 18 inch rectangle. Can you give me a little, a little pinky? Um, a little ramekin. No, 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 what? Oh! Hi, chingates. <laughs> so after we've rolled out our dough, in a little separate bowl, we're going to add one tablespoon of cinnamon and one fourth cup of light brown sugar. So we're going to spread on about three tablespoons of soft, unsalted butter. Now we're just gonna sprinkle our brown sugar and cinnamon mixture all over the dough. Now we're just going to gently start rolling this until we have a log. So meanwhile, I'm going to lightly grease. This is around like a 10 inch um, circle pan. Now we're able to cut our cinnamon rolls. Just try to eyeball it, get it as even as you can. Cut off the ends so you can get them even. So now you can cover this with aluminum foil or plastic wrap and leave it in a warm place to rise for about 60 to 90 minutes. So we'll see you back here in a bit. So it's been 90 minutes and our cinnamon rolls have almost really much doubled in size. Now we're going to bake these in a 375 degree Fahrenheit oven for around 25 to 28 minutes. So now we're going to work on the glaze for our cinnamon rolls. We're gonna start with two ounces of cream cheese. To that, we're gonna add a cup and a fourth of powdered sugar. We're also gonna add three tablespoons of milk and one half teaspoon of pure vanilla extract. And now just mix that all up. So after our cinnamon rolls have been cooling just for about like 10 minutes after we took them out of the oven, 
we're going to spread our glaze on it. Let's try this out. <laughs> that means it's good. I'll make some good shit. That, that's a cinnamon roll. Cinnabon, we coming for you. If you liked the video, be sure to smash that like button. And if you want to keep up with what we're going to make next, be sure to hit that subscribe button and the little bell next to it. As always, stay safe, stay awesome, peace.